the winter time, we still got some problems. Right? We do. Yeah, there is uh, a severe amount of pressure applied to foundations, more so this time of year than any other season. Really, grounds wet, ground freezes, ground expands. Think about the old uh, grade school uh, science class. You fill the ice cube tray halfway. You put it in the freezer. Mm. When you pull it out, ice cube tray is full. It's full. Yes. It's full. Uh, the same thing is happening in the top three feet of the ground. And it's real commonplace to come down and see your basement wall has actually started to tip in at the top. Mm -hmm. Or if it's blocked, say, two or three courses below the ground, you'll have this horizontal crack right. and a little stair step up at each corner. That's a sign that your basement wall is failing. Now it's not collapsing, hopefully, right. you know, but it is moving. And a firm foundation a is what you want underneath your house. You do not want that wall moving in and out. Right. It causes windows to break upstairs where they won't open and close, doors that stick, uh, cracks in the drywall. It makes it unsightly and really loses a lot of its property value. Right. It also will not fix itself. Once it starts in, it's going to progressively get worse and worse and worse over the years. Mm -hmm. The earlier you catch it, the cheaper it is to fix. That makes sense. And I mean greatly cheaper. If I catch it at the beginning stages, I don't need the backhoe. Mm -hmm. If you wait, I do need the backhoe. And then you lose decks and shrubbery and air conditioners and patios. And right, you're digging down. Right. But yeah. So please give us a call. It's a free inspection. We're happy to take a look at all your structural needs. Mm -hmm. 